Hi, this is Richard Byrne. In this video, we're going to take a look at three handy new features of Canva. And they all revolve around sharing your designs that you create. So let's just go and pick one of the designs that I've already developed. We'll use, let's say, this one here, my daughter's Christmas card. Now, when I click on this, we have a few options. So first of all, in the upper right corner, let's click on share. And this is where all the new features are. If I want to invite someone to collaborate on this design with me, I can, which is really helpful for someone like me who sometimes struggles coming up with a good looking design. I can invite people and they can become editors or viewers. I can also share it as a link in the same way. This is very similar to Google Documents. I can let someone edit or view. I also have a standalone link that makes the design into a very simple web page. And this could be a nice way to create a little flyer for a school event, a fundraiser, something to that effect. You just want to make a quick little web page. Using this publish option is a nice way to go about it. Now, it should be noted that not every Canva design is eligible to be turned into an interactive web page yet. Uh, it's still a beta service. And the last option is to simply embed your design. Now, to do that, you do have to make your design public. So we'll confirm my design is public up here. We'll share it. Now I can embed my design directly into a web page or blog post, just like I would do with a video. So those are the three new features of Canva. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetech4teachers.com.